Okay, here we are. Welcome back to Let's Fly DCS P51D Mustang. Uh, a little bit of a story time with the, the game updated to a new version, and we had some software difficulties that technically wiped out all my progress in the in the campaign, set me back to the beginning, but just a little rooting around and testing, I found the option to play the missions individually through the mission editor. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to continue with the campaign, even though it's not technically the campaign anymore. I don't know if anybody even cares. So what's, what's, he, what's his mission? Now that you've gotten the hang of blowing up things in the ground, let's test your skills against other aircraft. We'll start easy with a pair of lumbering MI-26 helicopters dead ahead of you. Shoot them both down. All right, sounds basic enough. And it sounds to me, it sounds pretty good to uh, get out of the realm of uh, ground attack. I mean, obviously, okay, P-51, it can do ground attack. That is an option, but it's not what this airframe was designed for. This is supposed to be an air-to-air -air machine. Okay, let's get things trimmed out. See if I can... See. I got two targets up there. Good. Two unarmed, slow-moving targets. Uh, he's dodging. Okay, it's getting kind of uh, kind of wild on some of the shooting. Not certain how many bullets I got into him. I've never been a particularly good shot. I thought I saw a little bit of a vapor trail out of him. Just ignore the second one for a little bit. Oh, let's not be stalling the airplane, Matt. Come on. Well, that's be embarrassing. Crash in this fight against a, an unarmed helicopter. Come on. Wow. Let's actually, let's just, we'll just scare him a little bit. Let me get my airplane s sorted out. What's, what's wrong with me? I need to pay more attention to my airspeed and my rudder coordination. Basically, just need to pay attention to everything. Okay, one flaming helicopter. Let's go for number two. Let's see those splash. Yeah, okay, we're not going to get seam splash, it looks like. Besides, I'm focusing on this one now. Uh, I think I just shot bolts and bullets through his rotors. Didn't actually hit anything important. Oh, no, he's not going splash. He's actually he's trying to make make the coast. Uh, he's not going to make it, though. Maybe he is going splash. Yep, that's a splash. Okay, cool. Yeah, helicopters, they, they turn really fast, even if they are slow, lumbering beasts. These, these particular ones are slow, lumbering beasts. I suppose some of these others may not be. Alright, I think I totally missed him. See, this is the problem. See, we're giving these these um, 
non-period accurate you know helicopters uh, because there's uh, in DCS world there is a definite shortage of World War II content shortage of any foes any targets uh, for the Mustang to go after. See, he's being kind of sneaky getting down there right on the deck like that. Kind of tricky to shoot when he's doing that. Without splashing my own self into the water. Definitely got a bunch of bullets into him. I think I saw some fire. Oh, yeah. He's done. You're done. Give it up. Nice auto-rotation splash. Oh, what? I don't get a... Well done? All right. Well, maybe it's a consequence of running this one, this mission through the mission editor instead of the actual campaign. Any case, that worked. All right. Mission accomplished. Let's go on to the next. Okay, that last mission was probably a little too easy. Let's ramp it up now by replacing those two cows with a couple of MI-24 hinds. Prevent them from reaching Batumi airfield. MI-24 hinds. Now, I don't really know a whole lot about my helicopters, but I know enough that I know that these are some pretty serious equipment. Uh, they've got those Gatling guns and chin turrets. These, these are armored. Uh, just going by the picture, it looks like they're not carrying air-to-air -air missiles, so that's good, because, you know, if they were, the uh, P-51, as cool an airplane as the P-51 is, is you know, from 1945, it's, it, this thing is defenseless against any kind of air-to-air -air missiles. So, my, my, I have two opponents, both of them, they, are, they have better guns, they have better armor, and they can turn a whole lot tighter than I can. Uh, so... I'm going to go fly in here, and I expect that my one and only uh, advantage in this fight is speed. Speed and also altitude advantage. Probably a better performance up at high altitude. If that, maybe I could trick him into coming and joining me up there. But yeah, I think above all... In order to survive this, let's try to not to let them point those Gatling guns at me. And let's try to keep my speed up. Get in and out of range as quickly as possible. So we've got, okay, there's two helicopters down there. Wow, those would be very difficult to spot without the tags, wouldn't they? Maybe I should try this mission without the tags. And not be... Don't want to uh, become dependent upon those crutches, you know? How about the one in front? Uh, he's swerving. I better pull out. Ooh, okay, please don't shoot me while I'm pulling out. Yeah, helicopters are pretty good at dodging. Dodging sideways like this. Oh, that's not... Oh, there goes my gun sight! No, I meant... Oh, oh, I... I dodged down. I was thinking I was going to dodge to one side, and he matched that movement. As like it, it all happened way too fast to talk about, and that was really sloppy flying on my part. But I got one of them. <laughs> yeah, see, look at that helicopter. That's a pretty serious helicopter, isn't it? Oh, there's our wreckage flaming back there. Yeah, look at that Gatling gun on the front of that thing. And Chin Turk and swerve around all the place, and he's got this second crewman whose job it is to aim that thing. Yeah, this is a pretty serious foe, actually. Okay, screwed that up. Let's go and try it some more. Alright, let's get back into it. Let's try to avoid any head-on collisions. Okay, 
because that was not the way that was supposed to work. <laughs> MI-24 Heinz. Yeah, I think we're definitely starting with the kind of the right approach here. I want to climb and get some significant altitude above these two targets and then dive down on them. So I take as much airspeed into the attack as I can possibly generate in order to exit the area very quickly so that they can't shoot me with those Gatling guns because I am scared of those Gatling guns. Say this time let's go for the rear one. I'm gonna leave the throttle in on this dive, see if it's possible to overspeed this thing. Oh, I see you turn it. Okay, turn. Oh, oh, oh! What what one burst and he amputates my wing? What is that about? Come on, come on, come on. Get me out of here, please. Thank you. Woof. Okay, that was exciting. Wow, one, one tiny burst. And he amputates my wing right off. Okay, guys, well, you, you win that round. That's no question about that. Wow. Thud. My dude, get up. Oh, good. He gets up. Uh, let me see what he does. Yeah, Wazdy doesn't do anything, but the arrow keys do. Can I make him run? Double, double, double chip, double tap. Jump. No. He d about all he does is he strolls around very slowly and contentedly. Uh, there go the helicopters. I failed my mission. Very sad. Okay. <laughs> Try it again. All right, once more into the breach, dear friends. St. Crispin's Day, yada yada, blah blah, whatever. Would it be cheating if I could have some air-to-air -air missiles and launch those for my Mustang? Yeah, it probably would be. It'd be cool though. Certainly, the rule of cool means we should that should be allowed. Uh, I may not know much about this whole air combat maneuvering and strategies of dogfighting and everything, but I know this much. You do not want to get into a turning battle hel against helicopters armed with Gatling guns. Oh. Hi. Okay, yeah, this looks to me like this could be generally overall a good plan to try and dive on them. Like, treat these guys almost like ground targets. Because I don't care how agile and how fast your helicopter can turn, I don't think you can point that Gatling gun straight up, can you? I know, maybe you can. Definitely got some bullets into that one. Oh, let's... Okay, okay. Don't... No, no, no. Oh, my wing's gone. No! Oh, man! What the other one? Don't we have one of these buttons where I can switch the... Yeah, I got this one. Look at him. Okay, okay. Well, this is... Progress. We have here evidence that the MI-24 is not invincible and that this diving on them from above, that this plan, it can be successful. I just need to be get better at avoiding the Gatling guns. Let's see, I want to see if he'll crash or if he can manage a landing. Uh, this is something, you know, uh, there are other sims where the, the AI pilots, if you know, the airplane's in trouble, they will not attempt an emergency landing. 
So this is uh, the more I play DCS, the more I like it. Wow, it's a rough, rough landing, dudes. I wonder if the crew will get out. Seem to be sitting. Uh, crew disappeared from out of the helicopter. Okay, so we don't see the crew walking away, but we do see them disappear. Okay, well, it's you know it's good enough. It's a yeah. There's lots of features of this of this sim that I really like. Okay, cool. Stop. Um, yeah, let's go and do it some more. Yeah, helicopters. So all the vulnerable parts are up on top, and their guns are on bottom. So you want to shoot them from above them and not get below them. This this is this is just like dog fighting against helicopters tactics 101 which I'm kind of thinking and imagining right now. And we're starting to get kind of slow because I'm climbing too aggressively. But we're about to come down here and do this dive anyway. Good. Definitely keep that speed up. Alright, that was sloppy. Climb back up. Get out of here. Don't black out. Don't black out. Come on. Just climb. Thank you. Do like a... Whoops! Oh, I thought I had enough airspeed to do kind of like a, a loop over the top. I was thinking doing kind of like a Cuban 8. Half a Cuban 8, Cuban 4. <laughs> oh, did I collide with him again? I thought I had enough room. It's over. So sad. Uh, I did collide with him. Yes, I did. Ah, okay, okay. I need to learn. I, I was cutting it too close. I thought, I thought I had enough room. I wanted to just barely skate by him so he wouldn't have room to turn around and track me. Interesting that I could collide with him and not take his rotors out. Alright. I don't know how the AI works in DCS world. I don't know if the AI... Are, are they aware of me up here? If I'm trying to dive on them out of the blind spot, do they have any... Say, like, radar and stuff? Do they know where I am? Okay, I think I got... I... And again, just one quick burst to the cannon. Frustrating, frustrating, frustrating. Okay, this is an experiment. I'm not playing this. This is re uh, replaying the track of what happened in the last mission. Let's see if we go to the uh, external cam. A uh, desert rat is what my airplane's calling itself. Isn't that interesting? I'm coming close to wanting to dive on them from behind. Above and behind, right? Yeah, there we go. Building up all kinds of crazy airspeed. Gonna try to get in and out quickly. Try and go to one side, so we'll exit the area to the left. Uh, totally missed him. Oh no, he didn't shoot me. I just, I think I just over G'd my airplane. No, they did not shoot me. This was just pure my fault. I just pulled too hard and I broke my airplane. That's all that's, there is about that. Okay, I need to be more careful with my airspeed in the dive. I can't just dive like that. Okay, okay, I take it back. It's, it's, I'm not getting shot. But, well, that one time I was. Okay. Yeah, okay, so for all my complaining earlier about the Gatling guns being enough to... Well, okay. If you do get caught by a good burst by those Gatling guns, yeah. they are enough to kill you, but I was just so scared of the Gatling guns that I was pulling way too hard, and I didn't recognize the signs of, of what the game was doing. I didn't realize that I was destroying my own airplane just by over -Ging the thing, you know? But that's, that's, that's what was happening. Ah, I think I missed.
So let's play cool. Continue to try and do some boom and zoom on them. Remember to pull throttle back in the dive. I definitely got some bullets in that one. Oh, he's smoking and he's spinning. Do you see this? Oh, he's done. He's done. Excellent. Okay. So we're down to one threat. Boom! He's gone. Oh, we don't get uh, congratulations for that one. To one more. Remember, we had that message once. Oh, okay. Don't over G. All right. All right. Good. I think I'm starting to figure some of this out now. Still need to be careful though. Uh, more careful in this. That guy's pointing his guns right at me. Ooh, yep, this is a good, pretty good burst right there. I think he was already too close for this maneuver, maybe? Nah. Definitely got some bullets into that one. And he's smoking and he's going down. Okay. He may just be smoking and dodging. Uh, let's just... I don't feel a need to do another pass at him. Let's just loiter up here. See what he does. Where do you think you're going? Maybe he isn't done. I think maybe he isn't quite done. That's well, hard to tell. I think maybe he needs a few more bullets. Because he doesn't seem to be crashing. Don't screw this up. You almost got you almost have the victory, Matt. Don't screw this up. Ah, I think I missed. Trying to do these deflection shots. Probably not so good an idea. Got a couple bullets into him that time. I know I did. In any case, I know that he's he's going exactly the opposite direction. Uh, you know, the the actual the mission goal was to prevent this guy from getting to my my home airfield, and he's going the opposite way. So. Pull up, pull up, pull up. Okay, I was kind of scared that I was putting myself in range of his guns right then. And I'm bleeding energy. I'm getting kind of low and slow, which is also a bad idea. on fire. 
There you go. Don't shoot me. Well, you're on fire. How long are you just going to keep flying with your helicopter on fire, dude? I see your spotlight, your flashlight illuminating the ground all over the place. I mean, really, give it up already. Just go down and die, would you? Starting to have some frame rate issues. I'm buzzing the ground down there, and we have the smoke trailing off the helicopter. All right, took his tail off. How about that, huh? End the mission now for a real challenge, huh? All right. You know what I've been forgetting for a long time? The celebratory F3 zoom cam. I think it was deserved this time. Good. Uh, was he making it for... I bet you he's trying to make it to this airfield. Is that an enemy airfield? Bet it is. No any aircraft down there shooting at me, though. Okay, cool. Any case, I think we'll end. That seems like a, a decent enough spot to end an episode. We'll cease recording. We'll come back and we'll do some more missions. How about that, huh? Yeah, I'll talk to you later.